Welcome back to the channel investors guys there is one penny stock that has rose over 120% just over the last five days and if you missed this stock I do believe I have the next one for you in today's video along with four other penny stocks including Eyeless that I do believe are ready to absolutely explode now if you guys missed the memo and did not realize that it is now October and that we are out of the summer months and on to Q4 October may not be the best month historically for large cap stocks but it is absolutely the start of the penny stock bull run at least according to prior statistics so october should really start the bull run here for penny stocks into the later part of this year and as we can see it is already getting started we can see ticker symbol fngr here which i put in the discord as a massive squeeze opportunity here is up 28 percent just today and is up almost 500 percent just over the last five days you can also see here here, ticker symbol GTII is up 79% over the last five days, 700% just over the last one month period, even after a slight pullback. We can also see ticker symbol GDVM here, which I've been talking about since 0 .006, is up over 153% just over the last one month period. So needless to say, October is starting off very, very strong. Now, if there was one place that you absolutely need to be here heading into October, and towards the end of this year to bank on all of these penny stocks early you better be in the private discord community and if you are not you are definitely missing out in fact you missed out on hundreds of percent gains from every single one of these penny stocks if you were not in the private discord community and I'm not going to talk about it a lot I'm not going to bore you guys at all however real quick you are also missing out on the penny stocks that I do not bring on YouTube whatsoever like ticker symbol CNTQ here as you can see ticker symbol C NTQ was called here at an entry price of $20 per share by one of the penny stock analysts in our private discord community this stock ended up halting up a couple times to almost $30 per share which left a $44,000 profit on this stock in addition to that we also took an overnight position on ticker symbol PEGY at $1.50 per share yesterday this stock was able to shoot up to about $2.70 today leaving it over 55% profit for this stock. So guys, if you are not in the private Discord community and you want to capitalize on these absolutely massive profits, get all of my penny stock trades early, trade options with us, and trade live with us every single morning at 9 a.m. The link to our website is in the description below or it is on the screen right here. Head to that website, get a subscription, one click, easy as can be, and you'll be trading live with us tomorrow at 9 a.m. But regardless, guys, getting into the video here, the first stock I want to talk about is ticker symbol P O W W. This is a M M O incorporated. Now I will be using some very selective words at talking about this video. So hopefully it does not get banned and you will see why. But regardless guys, this stock has an absolutely massive price target of over $9 per share, which represents about three X from where the stock currently sits right now. We can also see that volume is starting to pour into this stock very, very heavily. Just over the last couple of days, the volume has been double what it was the prior day and really the overall average and it is looking like today that this volume by the end of the day is going to close up even higher but before we get into some short-term catalysts here and how the chart setup is looking let's take a step back here and talk about this stock AMMO incorporated good growth but will it remain strong as it posts splits here so ammo incorporated is an American designer producer and marketer of that a word right there the stock first began trading on in the OTC in 2017 and later became listed on the nasdaq in 2020 right now they have two operating segments one of them an online marketplace which is which is a gun broker which is the largest largest gun broker on all of the interwebs and then they also have a separate manufacturing side now they have announced they will be splitting these into two different segments so the question really is do you buy before the split or do you ultimately wait until after the split but regardless taking a look at some of these margins and revenue growth 140 percent revenue growth over the last six year period is absolutely massive and we can also see down here taking a look at a DCF model that the stock is very undervalued and could have a fair value per share of around six dollars and fifty cents per share so as you can see some of their performance here grew sales and adjusted EBITDA by 34.1 million and 185 percent compound annual growth rate from 2018 to 2022 they also completed three acquisitions since 2016 which is 
almost $300 million worth of deals and acquisitions. They also uplisted to the NASDAQ, which as we know is absolutely massive and they're continuing to expand. So we're talking about a stock here, which net revenues increased 36% just from the first quarter here in 2022. They also have guidance of over $300 million for this year. Like I said, they're also continuing to expand by offerings an additional 440 retail locations nationwide and five new distribution partners. Now they're going to have access to over 10,000 nationwide retailers. Now, when you take a look at the chart, this is where it gets even better for the short term. This stock has been getting absolutely destroyed lately, and it finally looks like it is starting to bottom out. We can see this beautiful reversal candle here with a very long wick representing that buying pressure is coming in. At the bottom of the chart, this sure looks like a reversal pattern. Looks very similar to SOBR last week, and as we can see, that stock shot up over 65% just in the last five days. So like I said, guys, you're talking about a stock that is massively growing, is expecting over $300 million in revenue, has already done over $300 million in acquisitions in the last couple of years, and also has a $9 price target from Wall Street analysts. And in the short term here, the chart looks like it's reversing, volume is pouring in, we could see a very positive movement from this stock in the relatively near future. But of course, always do your own research first. Nevertheless, guys, I do believe I could have the next AMNL in this video for you guys, and not to say that this stock is done either, because I still think it has a lot of potential here in the near future. But the first of a couple stocks that I want to share with you guys is ticker symbol HMNU, which by the way, I talked about a couple days ago and had an absolutely massive move today and shot up about 35% at its highs today on some very good news. Shout out to Radio Silent for bringing me this place. Says take a look at the LOI and the chart, and also said looking forward to Brennan's YouTube video updates. So here you go. But of course, it's information that you already know. Nevertheless, infrastructure news LOI as an exclusive license deal. And you can see everything that the company is going to develop and market here down below. All of these things, you guys can pause the video, read over some of this stuff. I get a lot to talk about here. So I want to move on. But nevertheless, this company focuses on uh, green energy industry and also the medical industry. Obviously, they are crossing off acquisitions here in the medical industry with that. But nevertheless, like it says here, it is uh, the 0 0.0055 consistent with news on this LOI. They also have acquisition on big infrastructure contracts, which is going to settle some of the other part there, which is involved in clean energy. As you can see, this is going to add more money to the $24 million in assets that they already have. Massive upside potential. He says, do not wait for many people to start getting on this stock. Last run was to 0 0.055 and is currently a 10 bagger potential from where the stock currently sits right now. Now, the next stock on my list is going to be ticker symbol S O D E. The stock is sitting at just 0 0.046 right now of about 8% on the day. But as we can see here from hustle, uh, 042. You guys see what the chart is showing on the weekly up to 0.95. That is why we love the OTC. $1 potential with this stock right here, taking a look at the weekly chart. But we can also see from DD King here, SODE, huge upside with only 30 million outstanding shares, huge potential. Some of these companies like ChargePoint uh, booked $240 million in revenues. This has NASDAQ qualities. And he's saying this because SODE has a large focus on charging stations, which we know charge point does and brings in absolutely massive amounts of revenue now moving on here we can also see that you can see why I'm so uh, bullish here on the EV industry as a whole, EV charging stations, lithium companies. It is because so much news is continuing to pour out on these stocks right now. Hence why a lot of them are doing extremely well like AMNL. But as we can see, all 50 states get green light to build EV charging stations covering 75,000 miles of highway. You can even see from their website here, they're looking to capitalize on the 3.6 trillion annual global infrastructure bill, $1.5 trillion uh, US house bill that was passed and and California's uh, $14.6 billion bill they, they passed there for transportation. So uh, when you talk about the potential for these EV lithium, EV charging companies, it is just absolutely massive, which once again is why I'm so bullish on these companies. From Radio Silent here, ticker symbol A-M-N-L-B-R-L-L-S-O-D-E-I-I-N-X, all spoken on that Twitter space this year. Long accumulation on all these, all involved in the EV sector as a whole, and all have absolutely massive potential. 
potential. I know I'm just hitting on these stocks very, very briefly here, guys. There is so much to cover. I want to make sure I get all these stocks into you guys so you guys can do your own research before investing in any of them. But of course, every single one of these stocks, I put all the DD in the Discord and cover here before on YouTube. That is where we can talk all day long about these stocks and I'm not limited to any time constraints. So make sure to come join us down in the Discord if you want to get a deep dive on any of these penny stocks. But anyways, here, I'll wrap it up with two stocks. Number one is going to be STGZ here. This stock right now is sitting at 0 0.040. Now, Hustle has been pounding the table on this one right now and says one word, strong. Outstanding share reduction for the second time last week. This is going to be a great one for us all. I believe this will be worth the hold. We also are waiting for some big news with this company, which is extremely important as well. And they announced another reduction of its outstanding share. So STGZ could be a big one coming up here in the near future. Once again, just a little intro on this stock. Let me know what you think about it down in the comments below. And we'll wrap it up here with iList. Like I've said before, and I'll say it again, I think these buys 0.1 and under 0.08. 0.07. I mean, the best buy you could possibly get on this stock is going to pay off at some point in the near future. At least that is my opinion. We can see an update from Eyeless International here on Twitter with a strong Q3 resulting in further quarter on quarter growth for Eyeless. We remain well on target for $140 million in audited uh, run rate revenue this year. Our team assets are also growing exponentially in the short term. So Eyeless is one of those stocks that is one of the only stocks that I'm a long term bullish on in the OTC and is one of those stocks that just could be smart to continue accumulating those shares at lower levels unlike some other stocks which to me are honestly just quick swing trades but nevertheless guys a ton of great stocks in this video October is starting out to be an absolutely insane month already as we can see and there is also much more to come here in the month of October we are only in the first couple of days so you can believe we're going to get some more penny stock runners in this month and I do believe that some of these stocks in this video could be the next AMNL type runner and like I said that does not not mean AMNL is done. They do have a lot more coming up in the future. But guys, that is all I got for you in today's video. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed. And if you want more information on any of these stocks, the deep dives, the deep DD, all of our options trade, trade live with me every single day, make sure and join us in the private Discord community. Link is in the description below or on the screen right here. Get your membership one click and you'll be in the private Discord community. However, I do want to say shout out to ticker symbol POWW. Full disclaimer, this video was sponsored, at least the portion of this video talking about POWW was sponsored by them. Nevertheless, like I always say, no matter if a video is sponsored or not, you should always, always, always be doing your own research first. Do not invest in anything just because I say so. And as always, the full disclaimer is down below. Nevertheless, that's all I got for you guys in today's video, and I will see you all in the next one.